discuss some things that I've learned. I keep on learning new stuff. I've learned to take things slow. Like, um, don't rush. Because, like, I have re- I had fantasies for who they really are. Exactly. You just have to. Because life has its funny way of just bringing things right with you. What's up guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here and this is your first time seeing me, kindly do subscribe, tap on that post notification bell so that you may receive a post notification every single time I upload a brand new video. So, um, today's video is going to be a sit down video, actually just a chill one because as you can see I'm just clearly sitting down in my room and I want to discuss some things that I've learned. I think of course, um, every day we keep on learning new stuff and with this year almost coming to an end, there's some things that I obviously learned, something I learned. And so to help me, I have written down actually on this piece of paper. I have tried to write down what exactly I have, I have learned this year. And you may categorize into like, um, actually three. There is, there is friendship, it's money, the eternity. And so with that comes a lot. So if you want to enjoy, if you want to stick along, no. If you want to enjoy the video, kindly do stick along and yeah, without further ado, let's just... So I think I'm going to start off with, you know, I've wrote it down just because of the fact that maybe I forget a point that after, maybe during the process of editing and then is when I remember that, oh, I should have said this point, I'm like, oh, the video is up, I can't do anything, I should have said this point and this. So in order to avoid that, it's just good to, you know, write down. And yeah, so I think first I'm going to start with friendships. Like, okay, my biggest um, moment of learning this year when it comes to friendship is that, um, I should learn to take things slow like you know like um just don't rush because I've been um, in a situation like where my I've just been rushing like I have rushed into friendships I was just building up you know I had fantasies for lack of a better word this sounds this is from my own from my own experience I have had some fantasies and trying to make a friendship look a certain way slash or oh, okay I'm a, like um how do you say like trying to change somebody for for who they really are exactly so as in when you try to keep on changing somebody it may not be as in literal as in maybe you just want attention or maybe you just want the you know what you're putting in to be reciprocated back it's normal it's very understandable but you should learn one thing that you can never change anybody i think the only person you can change is yourself you just have to invest more into yourself try to be comfortable within yourself okay personally there's a difference between being desperate for a friend and actually just looking for a friend my situation was i was desperate for a close friend in other words so it's like um it's tricky and it's understandable to be either but you just have to learn like personally um the person who i i am referring to just taught me a lot of things actually patience and just let things flow naturally like you just don't have to force issues like just don't have to force. don't stress yourself too much on things you can't control Things which are out of your power, you know, it's very good to be spontaneous with life and with friendships. But then again, like, if things are, you know, way above your control, then there's nothing much you can do. All you have to do is just learn, adapt. We all live, we learn, we grow, and become better. When once you know better, you definitely do better. Also, if it was meant, as in, you know, when you're forcing something, it's just something not natural. Once you force something, it then comes off as artificial for lack of a better word so when you keep on forcing issues and you keep on forcing friendships like if it was meant it was meant and I actually learned again another thing like um the universe has its way of just bringing things to where they actually are supposed to be like i don't think there's a rule in forcing it's one thing i've learned so hard this year actually i had to really sit down with myself you know try to understand where i'm coming from and try to just be the better version of myself to stop forcing friendships and to stop you know if 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 somebody is at a certain period of their life where they just don't feel like they need your company then it's okay it's their own opinion it might hurt but you know at the end of the day it's actually you know you just don't have to force basically it as in i don't want to expound more because it will bring a long story and you're already four minutes and i've just discussed one thing so the next thing i'll go to is the aspect of spontaneity like as in you know this goes either for you as an individual or you with a relationship to, with another person in a relationship with another person sorry so um once it can either be a relationship a romantic relationship or also a friendship you know some things are just not not under your control some things are just meant to happen like if it was meant to be Trust me, whether you use route, route A, 
B, C, D, and the point is Z, you'll still arrive to Z. So either way, if it was meant to be, it was meant to be. If you can't control some things, you just have to, because life has its funny way of just bringing things right into you. I mean, of course, you should have a plan, but also be spontaneous. Like, I try to adapt and adjust to the situation. You can't just allow um, something to keep on stressing you because you really want to be in control of everything. No, some things in life are just meant to be the way that they exactly are so when you try to control stuff it might end up not working out for you then later leads to you know once you have this certain type of um idea or um a fantasy or uh, a vision of how things are supposed to actually be it's it's good i mean it's healthy but then again no you know like as in it's it's a double-edged sword like as in life has its own like it has its own things if some that's why i keep uh, i've said over and over again if it's to happen it will happen so when you force something it, it's just um either it will happen and have a either good or bad consequence ama it will not happen it'll just totally fail yani kabisa kabisa so i've just learned to be spontaneous in everything that do, that i do sorry i've just tried to learn to adapt to new situations because you never know what life throws at you things may come in very different angles different things you never expected them but it just came so you know you just have to learn to be adaptable and be spontaneous and like just don't give up but just you know just go with the flow just don't try to usijaribu control sana just go with the flow you know sometimes go with the flow not saying that you shouldn't plan you should obviously plan but some things just meant flow and just you just have to flow with it because if you think in it it's just like as in like you know you just can't escape the fact that it has to go this certain route and you don't like it and as much as you don't like it just try to you know adapt to your situation so the third thing is mm, mm, you know there is no right or wrong when it comes to life actually once you think of it there's no right and wrong so when you keep on like okay i mean i have judged people that is true keep on judging because you're all human i believe because you also have our own opinions about people ama about a situation which is your own opinion it's not the exact truth exactly so we're actually talking with a friend i think a couple i think last week i don't know last week on thursday or tuesday whatever but discussing about you know there's no right or wrong so you know when people keep on judging you like saying that i ingekuwa mimi singefanya hivi ama nini nini it's good that's you but you know we're all different there's no way in point and at a time in life where we will all experience the same thing we have to be different i think that's the whole beauty about life like you always have to be different there's no there's no way you will ever be the same as in we're the same we're human beings that's something in general but like we have different experiences based on our different personal you know like when i handle a situation like nikiona umefanya maybe kitu ngana like ah sasa mbona umefanya hivi ama mimi singefanya hivi you know that's because of my experiences those are the things which are i have gathered in life like the small small teachings like um the experiences i have learned over the over my period of time as i was doing a certain thing maybe i'm my whole life actually you know it comes down to to actually there's no right or wrong there's no manual and um to life like there's no way when is a semati this is how life should be like you know it keeps on changing and it depends on your experiences and everything so like i feel like um what i have learned is that there is no right and wrong because you never know what somebody else is going through you like once you put yourself in somebody else's shoes is when you'll be able to realize that life isn't as easy because you are reviewing it from your own point of view you actually you won't actually fully understand the person you'll just be like listen and try to understand using your own point of view and not using their own point of view hence the judging and all that kind of stuff so i feel like i've learned so much about like there's no right or wrong like there's no right and wrong there's no manual to life and there's no hurry time is there and also if it was meant to be it was meant to be like not forcing issues not trying to change situations which can't be changed you know there's some things you try to fight so much for but in reality it is just never meant to happen the way you want it to happen and it's okay it's life that's just how life is again leading to the point of which you should just be adaptable and be spontaneous i mean things happen randomly so you just have to prepare yourself and adapt to your situation so you know 
it's just I, I have learned one thing basically so what i can summarize and say that i have learned from actually this year 2021 is just one thing like if it was meant to happen it will happen like that's just it in friendships in like everything like i believe everything like if it was meant it was meant not leaving the fact that you should plan but if it was meant it definitely will find its way regardless like water knows its way to the, the sauce like at a if i knew any nip like it already took pale pale like it has a way to going back to where it should go so you know those are the few things that i've learned on this video to be so long but yeah so this those are just a few things i've learned i hope you have gotten to you know experience with me and if you resonate tell me down your experiences about the year 2021 you know tell me let's have a discussion in the comment section let me know what you think about what i have learned and also let us learn with each other you know like share experiences we also you know learn and grow because we keep on learning but this is quote i don't exactly who said that but it's just like as in when it comes to learning learning just learn as if you're going to live forever like we we as human beings never stop learning like it's a continuous process like it's unless you die you'll just keep on learning there's always new things to learn from and so when, once you learn you do better you you know better then you definitely become better so yeah those are the few points that i've learned i hope you have enjoyed this video i hope you have enjoyed this session leave me in the comment section what your experience is why let us share let us come together and let us you know learn together it's actually a fun thing to do so yeah without further ado just want to wrap up this video my vlog is actually coming up like in five minutes um so yeah it's a good shot okay usually you'd have already watched it and so yeah if you did enjoy this video please give me a thumbs up comment down below like comment share subscribe and if you subscribe kindly do tap on that post notification bell so that you may see the post notification every single time i upload a brand new video let's learn together <laughs> and yeah i'll see you guys on my next video until next time <laughs>